I'm only sorry that if confirmed, I won't have the privilege of serving there with Justice John Paul Stevens. His integrity, humility, and independence, his deep devotion to the court and his profound commitment to the rule of law, all these qualities are models for everyone who wears or hopes to wear a judge's robe. If given this honor, I hope I will approach each case with his trademark care and consideration. That means listening to each party with a mind as open as his to learning and persuasion and striving as conscientiously as he has to render impartial justice. Mr. Chairman, the law school I had the good fortune to lead has a kind of motto spoken each year at graduation. We tell the new graduates that they are ready to enter a profession devoted to those wise restraints that make us free. That phrase has always captured for me the way law and the rule of law matters. What the rule of law does is nothing less than to secure for each of us what our Constitution calls the blessings of liberty, those rights and freedoms, that promise of equality that have defined this nation since its founding. 